Hi everyone, Mike Mixon from KeyboardAmerica.com and .co. Welcome to our Genos Tyros Song of the Week and Buttons class. This week's song is another classic, I'll Remember You. And uh, I'm doing this as a ballad, even though I've heard Bette Midler do it up-tempo and whatnot. I've also put some grace notes on the music, and I'll be doing uh, a special right-hand look at what we're doing. So you can give it a shot, and uh, I think you're really going to enjoy it. Uh, we do have Genosis in stock in my big bundle, so give me a call if you're interested in getting one because we just got some in stock, uh, limited quantity, but we, we do have them. Uh, also, if you uh, want to look at our book bundles, just go to our Genos Tyros video lessons page on our website and all the book bundles are there, all the prices in every country. So let's take a look at the music real quick for I Remember You. Okay, so the grace notes are in red. Remember to print in color uh, when you get the music. We're using intro three, variation A on both units and on the uh, Genos and Tyros. The ba it was dreamy ballad, dreamy ballad, tempo 75. Now, of course, I've got all the new chords on there uh, that I put on there, so that's going to be good too. And also, where to change the variations is in blue. So let's get started looking at the chords for I Remember You. Okay, so you have a C major 7. to B7, C major 7, to G minor 7, to C7, to F major 7, F minor 7, G7, to C7. And remember to hold the notes down that I'm holding down. It makes it easy. G minor 7, C7. Back to your G minor 7 and C7. Now here's where it gets a little confusing. We're going back to an F major 7. And there's your B minor 7. So remember, we were playing B7. Now we're playing B minor 7. To E7. To A major 7. Back to your B minor 7. Back to your A major 7. Now here's where it gets tricky. Now we're going to A minor 7 to D7. Here's another one, G major 7 to G7, a one finger move. The only other chord in there is a D minor which is 5-3-1 and that's on your music so you'll have no problem with that one. Okay now we're going to move to the OTS settings for Genos and Tyros Remember, if you have the book bundles, it's going to be on the back of page one for both models. Okay, so on OTS-1, I've just got the CFX Concert Grand. OTS-2, what I've done is added Kino strings along with that CFX Concert Grand, and it's of course the Concert Grand on the uh, uh, Tyros, and at the same time we'll take a look at, um, there's the Kino String Low, and um, if you look at your mixer here, um, we've got the strings on 55 and of course the piano on uh, 127. On number three, I have my Glenn Miller sound, and we're at 
uh, volume 100 on right 1, 90 and 90 on right 2 and right 3. And we have clarinet, big band tenor sax, and sweet tenor sax. And that gives you that really nice Glenn Miller. <laughs> Great sound. Now, on OTS 4, we've got the Concert Grand CFX Concert Grand, Concert Grand on the Tyros, Kino Strings Low, and a Concert Cocktail, a cocktail Grand on right 3. Now, I also have the Harmony Echo on right 2 on the Kino Strings. So if you look at Harmony Echo, I'll hit direct access and uh, my Harmony Echo on the Tyros, Harmony Arpeggiator on the Genos, you can see that's four-way close there. And if you hit the toolbar here in the lower right-hand corner, you can see that's on right two and you can change it right there because it's going to default to auto probably. But that's important uh, for that particular sound and I wanted the full chord with one finger on my right two Kino strings there. Alright, moving over to the right hand because I did put grace notes on this music there's a couple different ways you can do it, and uh, the notes are there for you, so you'll be able to do this. And here's how I've got the first one. So it's... The next one. Little roll up there, okay? And here's another roll up. And a full chord. And those grace notes are right there on the music for you. And you can do it in a lot of different places. You don't want to overdo it, but you know, you can go this way. So you can see what the grace notes add to it, and I think you're going to enjoy giving that a try. But there's no set way you have to do it. Uh, even though I have it on the music, you don't have to do it exactly that way. That sounds nice, or this sounds nice. You can even do it here. And you can do a roll or just a right hand strike. Okay, so we're going to see what this is going to sound like. I've turned my auto fill in off and of course my OTS link on so that it will change when I change variations on the music. <laughs>
say So I know you're going to play that through more than one time, so you can bounce back and forth between the OTS settings and variations. And remember, you can leave a style on a variation and still push your OTS 1, 2, 3, and 4 button just to change the sound. So that makes it really nice too. If you do want to join us each week and learn a new song and get all the chord changes and settings and things like that, just go to our Genos Tyros video lessons page on our website and you will be able to see all the book bundles that we have there. We have two and uh, that's going to be enough to last four or five years. I also send you all of the past songs so you have everything from the beginning and of course my USB registration stick with settings on it and uh, also the banks that I have uh, set up right now. So until next time, this is Mike Mixon from KeyboardAmerica.com and .co saying have a great day, keep playing, and see you next week.